Hey loves and welcome back to my channel. This is your girl Sarah here. So today's video is about how to achieve this DIY Afro Kinky Puff. Details to all the products used will be listed in the description box below. As stated in the title of this video, I'm going to be using a kinky hair and, and the brand I'm using is from Darling Kinky. I used this hair already for a passion twist some time back so I'm just going to take a few of the braided hair cut it into two and separate them or fluff it out and that is what I'm going to be crocheting This crochet ponytail hairstyle is every girl's must have. It is that type of ponytail that you need and can help you just on the go. Our star model for this video is my beautiful mannequin head, AC. You all have seen her a couple of times if you're an OG on this channel. So I'm just going to place my ponytail string onto my mannequin head and I'm securing that down with a T-pin. The crochet pin I have is the big one and the holes in this string of the ponytail is a bit smaller so I'm just going to stretch it out so that I'm able to see the holes well. You all should not mind the little holes in the ponytail string because it just happened. So I'm just going to be doing my old fashioned crochet. I hope you all by this time know how to crochet because if you're an OG on this channel and you do not know how to crochet, I'm just wondering what you're doing. What have you been doing all this time? I need to catch up catch up and level up because we are the team diys and we have to do it by ourselves okay So I place the lash hook or the crochet pin into the holes, place my hair in the hook then close the lash hook so I'll be able to pull it out of the hole. Once it's pulled out to some extent, you just pass the other side of the hair through the hole to make a loop and that is how you do your crochet. I'll leave a link to a detailed crocheting tutorial on this video or in the description box below so you can go check it out. So I'm going to be crocheting that all through the remaining section of the ponytail. So please keep on watching. Once I'm done with my last piece of crochet, I'm going to fluff out the hair to see areas that need more filling. So I'll go ahead to crochet some hair into those spaces.
I want the hair to look a lot more puffy so I'm just going to use my hand to pull out the hair because you know kinky hair stretches out so I'm just going to pull out the hair to make sure it looks a lot more puffy I'm going to use combs as well to comb out the hair then I'll trim the edges to make it look a lot more presentable All done with the ponytail i'm just going to hold my hair to the position where i want my ponytail to be i want it to be at the crown of my head so i'm going to gather my hair all the way to the top of my head then slick it down with my echo styler gel
time for baby hairs i'm going to be using my x block as my edge control that x block slicks my edges very well compared to other edge controls so that is what i'm going to use to slick down my baby hairs Lastly, I will apply some holding spray to make sure that this hair doesn't move an inch. And if you're an OG on this channel, you know the silk scarf. That is what I'm going to use to keep this hair in one place. This is how the ponytail looks like. It has two combs in the side and a drawstring to help secure the ponytail to your hair. Once I'm done securing the drawstring around my ponytail, I'm just going to be using a bobby pin in to tuck the tip of the drawstring under my ponytail. All done ladies, what is left is for you to adjust the ponytail to suit your face. Adjust it, just shape it, use your hand to mold it to your preference. This ponytail hairstyle is every girl's must do because it's just out the door hairstyle. If you've watched to this point, thank you so much. My name is Sarah. Please do not forget to subscribe. If you found value on this channel, like and give me a thumbs up. And also leave your thoughts in the comment section below because I'd like to hear from you on what you think on this video and the type of hairstyles you would want me to make next. Until my next video. Bye.